Hello, I am Sentimus Prime, and here I will be reviewing the Lego Star Wars set number 75363, the Mandalorian N1 Starfighter Microfighter. Now, first and foremost, we will be taking a good look at the minifigures included. So, starting off, we do get the Mandalorian himself. We get Mando. And I will say, he looks really nice in minifigure form. I do like it. And thankfully, unlike the Boba Fett minifigure that I've, re that I've reviewed, also reviewed, he has a better contrast with his design. That is easier for my setup to pick up on. So here you get a good look at the printing. Which is nice. The helmet is simple yet elegant. I do like it. It's using the same mold as Boba Fett's helmet. But thankfully it's using a design simple enough. That it doesn't really mess with anything. I do like it. And the camera apparently likes it too because it doesn't have to deal with the darker colors of shades, darker shades of color. Still looks really nice. It does have this really nice backpack attachment. Really nice. And, he, and on his right uh, shoulder armor, he even has... His little, he even has, uh, let me pick it up, thank you. And on his right uh, shoulder pad, he even has his little mud horn emblem. That's a nice detail to include in. He appears to have a good amount of his Beskar armor. Very nice, I do like details. Has a really nice jetpack. That's cool. He comes with a pistol. Really nice. And because it's a small part, it this set includes another one as a spare, which you can attach to his other hand, so you can have him be dual dual wielding his pistols. Very nice. Do you like that? Now I should, I should probably like show off like the face design and how the face is printed, but I don't. But if I do that, it would probably like ruin Mando's dedication. Um, ru it would ruin his like reputation of like never taking off his helmet helmets, and I don't think I would be able to do that. And just psych. Here is a good look at his face print, and I do like it. He does have a little bit of uh, facial hair going on here. His head is of a nice color. I do like that. Now taking off his head to and his jetpack to show you the back print that would otherwise be covered with his jetpack. Also very nice. So putting the that back on real quick. Putting his helmet back on for his sake, for his religion's sake. And he'd be dual wielding his pistols once more. Now to take a, now we're going to be taking a look at the other character featured in this set and that is the man the myth the legend himself Grogu and he is such an adorable he's such an adorable wait hair what's that doing on my thumb no oh, whatever it's Grogu that's so adorable and of course <laughs> it would be included with the same sets as Mando such an iconic duo. Mm -hmm. Such an iconic... Such an iconic pair. I 
do like that. His now, of course, it hit, it's his specially molded little little head on a mini figure on a baby mini figure body. Very nice. There's a little bit of printing there to represent like his like his uh, robe thing. Also very nice. I do enjoy that. I, it's it's just so it's just so it's it's just so amazing. It's just so amazing to get both these guys at once. Very very nice. Now as for the rest of the sets, let's take a look at that. So. Here we get, so here we get like the, for the meat and potatoes of the sets, here we get a little, a cheap, a little, not, not cheap, cheapy, it's a little like cartoony representation of the ship that Mando flies later on in the series. But it, but it is very nice. It's been represented well enough. Obviously, not all of the details are there, but a good bit of it's like iconic shape. It's it has a rec. You can easily like recognize the shape of the ship as the ship that Mando flies. Looks very nice. The color scheme ain't bad too. It's it is mostly gray, like m most other uh, Star Wars sets. However, there is a nice, uh, there is a nice uh, contrast. It, there is a nice little hint of the key orange towards the back, which does add a nice bit of color to this build, which would otherwise make this like one of those like horribly like gray bland builds but but nice for them to add that bit of color i do appreciate that of course we get a little bit of green with the stud shooters on the front we can get to that later and there's also little hints of trans blue for the like like turbo thrusters or whatever they're called now towards the back there is like this rod, like mini, like, there is like this uh, rod tube build uh, towards the back, which, which is very nice. It does, it does give it uh, another feature that the ship had in the show. I do like that. Some might say it's very wizard. Some might say it's wizard. Here's how it looks from the bottom. Very cool. Or very wizard. I should probably stop saying that. And there's even a little tiny little windscreen. Which is probably not going to do anything. Because it's, it's a starship that's going to be in space and there's like nothing there's like nothing to like airlock all of this in in so best not to think about that let's talk about like the features that this thing has like these side uh thrusters they can swivel around they can they can turn they can spin around that's that's nice yeah, that's nice. I, I do like that. And, obvi and obviously, it has a, two. Obviously, has a pair of the stud shooters that just each fire these little these little uh, trans bright green pieces. Very nice. Reloading them is easy enough. It's just 
snapping them back in place. And you do even get spares. You do, they do even include spares so you can fire off more ammunition. Very nice. And of course, we gotta sit these guys down. So, let's sit Mando down. Now there is a bit of, now there is enough room for him to sit down even with his jetpack, which that is nice. Most wizard. Dang, I, I think, man, I think I just said that again. Eh, no matter. And then let's just sit, uh, Grogu down on this jumper plate right here. And that, and there's how they look. And there's how they look, uh, flying in their, in the, in their, like, little starship. Starfighter. Very nice. I do like it. I do like that there is a nice cozy place for Grogu to sit. I do. It's an it's a nice well it's a nice little it it's a nice little ship, with two of the awesome with the two awesome characters, two of the cool awesome characters. Do you like that? It is very nice. It's there is really cool. I do. Like that, and of course, uh, and of course, there are no, uh, like, boat piece things, like, through the bottom, but you can, but if, but on, like, a more specific surface, like, mouse pad like surface, you can slide it around and, like, pretend it's, like, speeding through the, the planes. So that is nice. Really, really cool. And so my overall thoughts on the set. I honestly really like it. It's... Now, I will say it is... The price the price per part ratio on this is not that great. I would say. But... But I will say, you do get a nice handful of parts that are really interesting to see what you could use, how you can use them, especially with some of these like more interesting parts, like this part back here. That's a really cool part. There's a lot of nice parts in the set, even if you don't want to build this. Really cool, and it's a nice. It's a nice, uh, affordable way to get both of these two got both of these two at once. I'd really appreciate that. Like, imagine like getting both of these two at once. Like, and you don't even have to pay for like a giant like Razor Crest uh ship or any of that. You could just get the two, you could just get the iconic duo as they are. And also with some pe- and also with some pieces to make a tiny little, uh, starfighter. Really, really nice. And I guess if, and I guess, uh, I guess someone could, like, utilize the parts in the set to, like, make, uh, Grogu's little, like, floating, uh, his, like, floating, uh, his uh, little, like, floating bed that he flies around in. I guess someone could make that using the parts from the sets. That would be really cool. Hmm. I might, I might end up doing that. Eventually. But for now, I guess I'll be it for this video. If you enjoyed this review, 
consider to like and subscribe and maybe even comment if you want. And of course, I will be posting again sooner or later.